Hi students, <clears throat> I am Dr. Badrinath. In this video, we will see the solubility table which is given in the USP and IP, Indian Pharmacopoeia and uh, United States Pharmacopoeia. Uh, this comes in the subject of physical pharmacy unit one and this is the syllabus. Uh, the solubility expression, I completed the my video. Okay. And the solubility table comes under that only, solubility expressions. It is a part of solubility expressions. Okay. And we know the basic concepts of uh, uh, solubility and the solution. Well, the solution, here you can see the solution, it consists of a both solute, generally it is a solid, okay, in generally. And solvent is the liquid. If you are dissolving a solute into a solvent, then you will get a solution. In the solution, we cannot see the solute solid particles as such. We cannot see. Only it is in the dissolved form. There will be a change of phase. Solid phase converted completely into the liquid phase. Uh, yeah, here you can see the USP and IP, United States Pharmacopoeia and IP has given the table, uh, solubility table. That table depends upon this. See here, one part of solute solute one part how many parts of solvent is required for one part of the solute okay here they didn't given grams ml nothing and all only they mentioned simply part what is meaning of the part most of the students they are confusing what is the part means any fixed measure any fixed measure Either it may be spoon, you take a standard spoon. Okay, that's it, one spoon. The same spoon you have to use for the both solute and solvent also. Or you can use the steel cup. Here I used the plastic spoon. We are using for the measuring of the uh, our washing of our cloths. We are taking the powder, washing powder with the help of a spoon. Any fixed measure. Same measure should be used for the both. What you are using for the solute, same you have to use for the solvent. That is called as a part. Okay, in the textbook, they didn't give in the definition and students are confusion. For one part of the solute, how many parts, how many parts of the solvent is required? That is a question mark. Based on that, USP and HIP has gave a standard table. This is the standard table. This is called as a solubility table. Here you can see the description, very soluble, freely soluble, soluble, sparingly soluble, slightly soluble, very slightly soluble, practically insoluble. All these uh, descriptions you have to use as such. Okay, we cannot use uh, our uh, with our uh, discrimination. Okay, as per the U U USP IP, you have to use. And how many parts of the solvent required for one part of the solute? See here, very soluble. It requires only less than one part of solvent is more than enough. To, uh, that's why it is a very solvent, very soluble. Second thing, freely soluble. One to ten parts is enough. That's why it is a freely soluble, 10 parts of the solvent for one part of the solute. Soluble, this is the standard actually. Here, this you can be take as a standard soluble, 10 to 30, 10 parts to 30 parts. Here, 30 to 100 parts, 100 to 1000 parts, 1000 to 10,000 parts, more than 10,000. See, observe the first one and the last one. First one is less than one. And here, last one is greater than. Only one number you will get. Here also one number. Here also one number. Remaining all two, two numbers you will get. Okay. And more than 10,000. Like that. And you have to practice. This is very important for competitive examination. This type of question they are asking. They will give very soluble. And you have to tell how many, uh, how much quantity of a solvent is required. Like that. Okay. Here, uh, shortcuts are there. If you want, you can be uh, use this. Very soluble, Vs, less than 1. Freely soluble, 1 to 10. Okay, soluble, 10 to 30, like that. Sparingly soluble, yes, otherwise you will get confusion both. Sparingly soluble and slightly soluble. Sparingly soluble, okay, 30 to 100. 
and 100 to 10,000 SL like that. You can uh, shortcuts or some tricks are also there. If you want, you can uh, continue the uh, video. The, actually, the concept is over now. The concept is over. If you want to see the tricks, you can continue the uh, video. So I have divided the solubility table into seven days like that. See, seven terms are there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I divided Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday like that. I divided. And if you generally Sunday, we are not considering as a complete day. It is less than a day. We are considering because we are not going for the work. No, that's why. Like that, you can remember. Very soluble. We are uh, very soluble. So no work at all like that. And uh, freely soluble. See, free, this term is important. Freely soluble. 1 to 10. So here, Monday, there is a bumper of a buy one, get to two free. This Monday also now need not to be remembered. Only for Sunday, you can remember this one, less than a day. For this, days are not required. Seven terms are there. Okay, total. Free means buy one, get to 10 free. Like that one bumper offer is there. Soluble. Generally, we are saying it is a solute is disappeared in the solution. Ready, one, two, three, like that we are saying. No, in the same fashion, ready, 10, 20, 30. Like that, we can be use it. And sparingly soluble, spare parts. Spare parts sizes are available from 30 to 100. And slightly soluble. Slightly. Slight means very, uh, that is light or sight you can keep in your mind. Sight value, you, you are invested 100 rupees on Thursday with the Baba's grace. So 100 rupees is uh, increased to 1000 rupees. Like that you can remember. Sight value is increased from 100 to 100 you invested. So it is a 1000. Next Friday, it is a goddess of Lakshmi Devi. In Fridays, what you did, 1000 rupees you invested in another very slightly, various slides, very slight, various slides, invested 1000 th rupees. So it became a 10,000 rupees. Okay, like that you can remember. And practically insoluble. P, I, N. Here only you will get insoluble. All are here, see, you will get the term of soluble, 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 soluble. Here you will get a insoluble. That is P, practically. P, I, N. You can remember. Pin is empty. Empty. More than 10,000. That is a empty. Like that started. So, you can, if you want, you can be use these tricks. Otherwise, you can keep directly the, uh, remember the, all the terms. Okay, thank you. So I will end my session here. And in playlist, I have kept all uh, subject-wise, all my videos. Okay, you watch them.